Who goes there? Do not disturb me as I am working. Hmm? I sense a medium powered level demon behind me. Freshly made demon. Ah, I see. Welcome. Sorry for the rude introduction. I've been quite busy during these pressing times. You'd have to excuse my arrogance. So go on, speak your name. A pleasure. I am Ein's own ghoul. One of the most powerful sorcerers all around. And anything to do with magic in all necessity, I am at the top of the pinnacle. Do you need my assistance of any matter? You do. I guess I can spare you a few minutes or hours. So tell me, what is it that you need from me? Ah, you're here because of the village not even that far from here. You want to be human again. Well, I'm not sure what type of ingredients I have to make you a potion to do such things, but I will see what I have. Let's see here. Let's see. No, we don't need that. Ah, uh, here we go. The drop of a human blood. Um, let's see. Pig skin. Hmm. Dried up human heart. That goes in there as well. Hmm. There's something that I'm missing. Oh, what is it? Oh, I remember. You, come here. Soul Reaper. And the soul of the human. Mix that all together, and um, we should see. Perfect. This elixir is called. Oh, what was it called again? If I had my assistant Alberto here, she would know the name of this elixir. Ah, I remember. The Elixir of Rebirth. That is the name of this elixir. It could cure any type of unworldly beings doing. In short, drink this, and you will turn back into a human. And you will never, ever need to worry about any type of side effects at all. This will cure you. Drink it. Although it might be a bit bitter to the taste, it will still cure you of everything. Why did I need your soul? Well, if I said it directly to you, you'd be less or more surprised that I needed a soul for this. So, I used my own powers to take your human soul and separate it from your demon body. And you basically just drank it back up. It's simple cantations. It's not really that hard to get your head wrapped around. Hmm. 
You look very confused. Is there another problem you have with me? I see. So, what happened here was, you've gotten blood from two powerful demons, and that's the outcome of it. Your body was just like that, and you gained the power of time travel. <sighs> well, if you must need it, time travel is a very... Mm, uh, energy costing spell. It'll put me down for at least a week. It takes quite a lot out of me. And I need to make a few things, get a few materials before I can make this spell actually work. It's quite a big spell. I need a big, I need a big summoning circle and a bunch of supplies. If you are willing, you could go into that dense forest called the USA and get me my supplies. It would be quite dangerous, but I feel like you have just enough skill to get me the things that I need for this. Are you up for the challenge? Very well. I will have somebody assist you in mourning. Because as of right now, it is too late. And the creatures that I need dead only are around in the morning. You understand, correct? Everything that I have taught you, everything that I told you, and everything I have done to you, you understand it completely. Good. You're smarter than you look. If I use this power, you will go back in time to fix this world, will you? <laughs> Although I do miss slaughtering all sorts of different timelines of people, this timeline I will miss. For I was useful here as a healer and not a fighter. But all good things must come to an end. As of all good things. Now, here is the list that I will give you. All the ingredients I need are on that list. Don't lose it. Or I will come for you and behead you myself. Do I make myself clear? You're the one that came to me for help. And so in return, you are going to help me. If you're going to really fix this world, I do not want to waste time. So as the sunrise strikes the sky, I want you to be awake and ready. I will have my assistants support you through your journey. Matter of fact, I will have Alberto assort you. There is quite a lot of danger out there. I hope you're ready for it. There are some strange creatures around there. Ones that I have not seen, even in my world. Yes, I am from a different world. I have chosen to time travel for at least twice. And this is where I was stuck upon. This place of Earth. This rubbled, shriveled planet. It's my home. But it won't be for long because of you. I trust you to do everything correctly.
Now go. I have very important things I must get back to. Farewell. <laughs>